Hello, so this week I was working on uh, a proof of concept implementation of an OpenMS Alexa skill. Um, yeah, everyone who wants to try out needs a, a free Amazon developer account. Um, and you need to deploy the servlet on an SSL enabled server using the standard HTTPS port. It took me ages to figure out that only 443 is working. It's not documented anywhere on the Amazon <laughs> website. Um, of course, you need a running OpenMS instance, and I focused on the device with on the echo devices with screens. Um, yeah, it will work, but I had, I have not um, created the 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 cards. That's another yeah. way of um, yeah. presentation of the data. Mm -hmm. um, to get an idea of the basic operation, you see the Echo device. Um, it communicates with Amazon. The Amazon is communicating with the servlet we are cre cre uh, which I have created this week. And the servlet itself is communicating with your OpenMS instance. So this was a little bit of challenge to set up a development environment because of yeah the SSL enabled server. So my OpenMS box at the Fulda University is uh, has an SSL certificate running on the standard port, and I created an yeah. A proxy entry in the Nginx configuration to point to my VPN address of my notebook here. This works for development, but of course, the echo device is here and is its request is going to Amazon, Amazon to Germany, to the Nginx, back to Minneapolis. Then my surface says, okay, I want to query data from OpenMS, go back back to Germany, query the data, back to Minneapolis, back to Amazon, and back to Minneapolis. So usually, usually uh, Alexa responds a little bit faster if you ask her something. So that brings me directly to the demo. So hopefully it will work. Alexa. Show notes, uh, no, yeah. Alexa, mm -hmm. Alexa, open, open NMS. Welcome to the open NMS Alexa scale. Alexa, show notes. These results were found. Alexa, uh, pick two. Node number 226, 192.168.31.132. Alexa, uh, show auditors. These Alexa. results were found. Uh, pick one. Outage number 56,748, seven hours ago, interface. Node HP Color Laser Jet M553, service HTTP. Uh, show alarms. These results were found. Alexa, pick two. Major alarm number 74183, seven hours ago. And um, additionally, you can also ask her for if something went wrong, just to give uh, to to get an overview of do I have any alarms or auditors? Alexa, uh, any auditors? Sorry, I yeah. don't know that. You can say try saying help. Alexa, any auditors? <laughs> Alexa? There are 30. Oh. <laughs> uh, now you get an idea of how I was struggling with the device. Is there anything else I can do for you? 
Uh, any auditors? There are 32 ongoing outages. Nodes affected, 28. Alexa, any alarms? There are 23 unacknowledged alarms. Highest severity is major. So that's basically what I have achieved this week. <laughs> and uh, all the code is available at the OpenMS Forge, OpenMS Alexa repository. Um, building is quite easy. Just check out, go into the directory and invoke Maven Wildfly colon run. Um, further instructions for setting up the Amazon developer account is in the readme. And yeah, everybody is invited to contribute. <laughs> <laughs> Any questions? Uh, so every, everybody needs its own developer account because everybody needs to define its own. Yes, currently I have I have no no mechanism created to uh, connect your Amazon account with your OpenMS instance. Like okay. usually a skill will do. It's just a proof of concept of the so for, stuff. For, for a real deployment, we have to provide some kind of service. Exactly. People can enter their open and MS credentials. Exactly. And exactly. Okay, yeah. So for now, you have to run your own surflet for. Okay. Yeah. So what if we use like a Lambda function? Maybe. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I didn't check out what you said. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Feel free. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.